In a missing person case we've been tracking for weeks now, Texas EquiSearch volunteers are scouring an area in the third ward looking for any sign of the woman who's been missing since June 25th. Her name is Brittany Burfield. She was last seen in Sugar Land, but new clues today are pointing investigators to the third ward. And that is where our Lee Felici is live now with the very latest on this search, Lee. Keith, I just got off the phone with Tim Miller from EquiSearch, and he tells me the weather has been very tough on them today. First, there was the heat. One of their volunteers had to be treated for heat exhaustion. Now there is the rain. But they will be out here searching for another hour because HBD has asked them to stay on this case. An HPD search in the third ward led to another clue as to what may have happened to 37-year-old Brittany Burfield. HPD says they found some of the woman's clothes in a lot on Drew Street then. They called Texas EquiSearch to comb the area. Uh, I was hoping for the, the best, of course, but fearing the worst. Tim Miller and his Texas EquiSearch team took to the streets, digging in some places and wading through tall grass, searching for signs of Burfield. Volunteers started where police found the clothes, then circled outwards. So we always start out at that, that last place, and whether that was the last place or not, I, you know, I don't know what led investigators there. And it's the second time EquiSearch has set out to look for Brittany. At the beginning of the month, volunteers searched a wooded area in West Houston, not far from where Burfield's abandoned car was found. Now, another clue and another search, but still no sign of Brittany, which makes it difficult for her family. She was last seen on June 25th when she visited her mother in Sugarland. Been pretty distraught since it all happened, so um, we just want to let them know that you're not alone. We're we're here with you. So I'm told HPD has talked to a person of interest. They've taken that person downtown for questioning. Also, EquiSearch says they'll be right back out here tomorrow morning to resume their search. In Southeast Houston, Lee Felici, KPRC, Channel 2 News.